Hi friends, this is Susie, your Candy Crush Guru, here to help you solve the puzzle of level 2722, where we have 15 moves to clear out 51 jelly and collect 4 ingredients, and everything on this hinges on whether or not we can get these cake bombs removed. We've got this licorice locked licorice in the center that's a distraction here. We do have bobbers, and I've noticed that the fish do attack the cake bombs, so that's a benefit to us. But we still have a lot of work to do, and I don't particularly like this setup. I know that I can exit and enter over and over without losing any lives if I do so before I take my first turn. This looks a bit better. I can get a stripe here. I'd rather have a wrapped ready for me to go, though. So I'm going to hold off and continue to do this. I'll pause the recording and meet you back here when I find a better board. I've had a really hard time trying to get that wrapped candy set up. So what I'm going to do instead is just bust through here and give myself more space to make more matches and specials. I can do a wrapped candy now, but it's not going to last. So instead I'm going to make a stripe that'll cut through here. And now I get to do this. Now let's see what I can get done. Ah, uh, that would fall too low to match with this. So there's no problem in me pulling this downward a bit. Hmm, that's not so good. But it's not so bad. It'll hit the edge of this, and it'll hit this, and we know that these bobbers send off fish that are pretty intelligent, much more intelligent than most boards. So we're actually going to get a cake bomb gone, and a little bit more of this cake bomb gone. I love that. And now I've got more real estate, more of an opening to try to get this to happen here. <sighs> How can I get a stripe set up with this? I can make a stripe or two, but how do I set them together? Yikes. Okay, I got it, almost. I think this will work because I can hit this, and that fish will go to the very last spot. And this is only one layer underneath, and so I think it will be taken out by the blast. Let's see if we have any residue underneath or if this is enough to take care of it. Now the fish doesn't know where to go or what to do. All right, let's see. There we go. So that's how I beat this board. Uh, this was my sixth playthrough for recording purposes. It was a little bit of a struggle, but I thought it was kind of a fun one. And I'm glad I didn't wait around forever to get that wrapped candy to set up because the other, you know, three or four times that I used a wrapped candy, it didn't work out so well for me. So getting that opened up more quickly ended up being a better strategy than the first one I thought of. If you'd like to see more videos, you can subscribe. If you have any questions or comments, please put those below. And as always, thanks for watching.